What's up, fornicators? Today, I want us to talk about why a fornicator should not cry over a breakup. You are not supposed to cry over a breakup. And I want to give you just three points why you are not supposed to cry over a breakup. Number one is the mother of all laws is the law of impermanence. Like there is nothing which is permanent. There is nothing which lasts forever. Even if you get into that relationship and till death, do, do, till, I don't know what you fucking guys say. I, I don't know you say till death do what us. <laughs> so that is, that is, that is like, uh, even if after you die, it means that that thing was not permanent. So, you have to understand that all relationships are not permanent. At some point, you stop being close to me, I stop being close to you, and that is all. So, the moment you realize that things are... Uh, um, the moment you realize that not every everything is not permanent, you have to understand that even that relationship can reach at a point and it dies. And what you have to do is to practice acceptance. You have to accept. You have to accept and even move on if they immediately have the breaker that is just one second after so uh, I want to tell you that some connections are not permanent like you it is energy and some energy can harmonize up to a certain point and you find out that now these energies these two people are not getting attracted to each other they are repelling each other like everybody has a certain kind of magnetic field around them and that's that's why we say this world is actually run by energy positive energy and negative energy so i just let let me not go into technical details of this shit so let me go to number two point number two is benefit like we get into relationships for a certain kind of benefit you might not realize it but every relationship you are valuing it is giving you a certain kind of benefit so if you stop getting these benefits then you feel like now why am i fucking here why am i here so if you are not getting any benefit, please just leave and move on after that second. So, I am not talking about, uh, let, me, let me talk about point number three, that is, believe in yourself. Fuck, let me explain that technically, by the way. If you believe that you are good enough for that person. Why are you feeling pain when they go? Why can't you believe that they have lost you and you and you are a diamond? You are something which is valuable. Why can't you believe that they are the ones who have lost, not you? You are always thinking that you are the one who has lost. That's why you are feeling pain. Fuck yourself. See? So, let, let me stop there today. And uh, please, don't ever cry of a breakup. And feel pain over anyone. So, 
because we are here to live just a one life. So.